Hi, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Tressa Jam. My name is Quita. You can call me Quita. You can want to do as as a vote. Please like, share, subscribe, donate, all that good jazz. If you want to book a read with me, you're more than welcome to. If you want to book a one-on-one -on -one session with me, you're more than welcome to do that. And if you want to donate to Heaven on Earth, everything is in the description box below. This is going to be a quick message. Somebody's ex is lying on them. Um, somebody's ex is like habitually lying on someone just um, because they're in this five of pentacles energy. They thought that they would be able to come back in and out of somebody's life because for years or maybe months, that was a pattern for, I'm getting years. It could be almost 10 years. Um, that was the pattern for this person to come in and out your life. It could be under 10 years. I'm not getting a specific number, but Spirit is saying years. Um, this person is on drugs. That's why they uh, have these tendencies to lie and stuff like that because it alters the perception. And not only are they lying, they are crying. They are crying because of your purpose. They are crying because and scheming because of your purpose. Because when you, I guess when you left them or you broke up or however it went, when the broke up, the breakup broke the, <laughs> when the breakup happened, the broke up breakup, however you want to put that, when that breakup happened happened, um, this person, they thought like you was gonna come back. They thought like that you will be sad without them and they see that you're thriving without them. They see that you're doing good. So they're throwing rocks and hiding their hands. Um, and it's all because they're paranoid. Um, they're doing drugs. They are um, basically so indifferent about your um, gift, your calling. They probably doubted you for the longest and they probably were the person that, the, the biggest person that was holding you back um I, I do feel like they're scheming and and they're trying to they're losing control um they are not taking care of their mental health their physical health um because they just thought you would be back by now and you're not back you're not feeding into any of their i, I feel like if you're like me i'm the type of person you don't exist to me anymore especially if you do some not even borderline so you just went all just yeah when you went all the way out your way to do something you didn't have to do it a lot of people who are like that there a lot of people take drugs and it alters their personality it also it alters their perception so instead of doing something positive they're more apt to do something negative because they're already addicted to drugs uh, I'm talking to somebody that's heavily addicted to drugs, probably been on drugs, and you probably don't even know about it, for years. And that's why this person don't have a lot of money, that you don't know what they do with their money, and this person may act nonchalant about it, and very um, good at hiding their drug problem, but and they are very good at functioning with the drugs, but nevertheless, this person is very um, indifferent about your calling, your purpose, um, they saying that it's lies, that you're a liar, but spirit said through all the suffering, you still gonna shine brightly because you stand strong, you stand in your purpose, healthy boundaries. I'm, I'm getting somebody that's a really high vibrational. You have healthy, healthy boundary, boundaries. You have healthy coping mechanisms. A lot of people don't have hope, healthy coping mechanisms. I'm picking up on somebody that does. I'm picking up on somebody that, um, you may not be perfect, but your so your ideal of what uh, a a true partner should be, and they this person understand that how they say you you fumble the bag, but they fumbled the purse, their person. They fumbled somebody who was gonna be there through thick and thin. They fumbled your your connecting with you in a whole wholesome way. They fumbled their own blessing. So that being said, you guys, I'm out. I hope this helps. Peace. Much love.